Hello, greetings, I'm Nambundo Tzede, and I'm a medical doctor by profession. I currently work at um, Department of Orthopedics, which is a subspecialty about bones that I would like to pursue my career and specialize in or under. Um, I finished my metric in Villa, at Villangai High School, and I did my degree at UKZN, Nelson R. Mandela School of Medicine. How I would say I made it, it's not just one thing, it's uh, multiple factors. Um, a whole lot of things contributed to making me a better person as I grew and got inspired and got closer to my dream and career. So starting from high school, I had a very good learning culture instilled early or earlier on. Um, during my high school years as we were always studying we we knew that there's no other way of getting good results you have to work hard you have to study all the time if not most of your time so this helped me from high school and also helped me in varsity throughout varsity I already had grasped um, the idea of studying hard and studying all the time so when we were in high school, we would wake up in the morning, study, have other students who understand better the subjects, and they would teach us. Teachers didn't always have to be there or tell us what to do, what to study, when to study. We, we, we were driven. And also, we also had people who made it or who were already in varsity studying and doing their, degree, their degrees. They would come, they would come back at, 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 at our school and motivate us. And this used to be very helpful because these are people that you knew from the community coming from nowhere and you we could see that they are there they are literally working towards their goals and their future so it had a very positive in, impact in um, in our lives back then so um, I'd say that when you are a young person you just have to associate yourself with good doing good just do good from the beginning so that you won't have any regrets and you won't be working towards cleaning anything or mess in your life if you have messed up then pick yourself up and carry on working it really doesn't have to be from a well-off family knowing where you come from your background should also be one factor that pushes you know that when you are studying towards your career you are doing it for yourself you are doing it for your family you are doing it for your community and the country at large you are not just doing it for yourself only and keep working keep working hard towards that dream and goal um be goal driven all the time and don't be scared to look for help and ask for help and spending all your time in with your books because as you learn that culture of working hard and better in yourself you will be better and you will do better um there were teachers who used to play a huge role um they would give us motivations tell us about their background how they also made it very inspiring stories. They will tell us about other kids who were from disadvantaged um, backgrounds and how they had already made it. So in a way that you don't have to feel ashamed of your situation, you have to be the change that you want to see. So if your family situation is really bad, you have to be the one to change first in order to make that situation better. Um, we had Bao Mahai always teaching us about life, teaching us about the subjects, teaching us about discipline to work hard all the time. We had um, a lot of teachers, Mr. Ntuli, Tishun Demande, Tishu Kazu, a lot of, of these people played a role. We had Mima Mahai teaching us mathematics 
you know sometimes it's really nice when you have a lady um who you can see and relate to telling you it's possible my child it's possible um my boy do this do that so you guys must just grab the opportunities that you are granted and be thankful that you are able to go to school and use the opportunity and do well we are here now we did our degrees yet there's still specialties that we have to do so it becomes a big learning curve that you just have to carry on and work hard and work hard and work hard i thank you